Good morning, everybody, and welcome to episode 37 of Pumpkin Days with Camille in Pumpkin Vale. That's right, it's been a couple of days since I played this, so I'm just checking what I'm doing, trying to work out where I'm at. Okay, let's check out Jay for Journal. Oh boy, what did I say I would do? Consider right for Tucker. Alright, that's gone. Just get rid of that. Yep. Okay, black tea, mustard, green tea, eggplant, light tea juice. So now backpack. There's the light tea juice. There's Tucker's. No, that's not Tucker's tofu. You know why? Because he needs one more. Yep. Sugar for Tannis. Barley for Zoe. Okay. <sighs> and the backpack was nearly empty. That's correct. We were also looking at uh, what we did with our museum. So we've done all the flowers, except for the one that's not yet available. We have Cassiterite to get from our minerals, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, ten others. All right. So that's probably our focus. Is will be the ores, the fossils and the artifacts. We've returned all of our tablets. Yeah. All right. Those are our statues. That's our rooster sculpture. Did we return that already? Yes, so I can sell those. All right, so we, we have artifacts as well. So we're basically going to go on a bit of a digging spree. Okay. What food did we have in our pack? That's not good. Oh, I did have some considerate. Okay. As you can guess, I've forgotten what I'm doing. Did I make myself my shiny new axe? I did make myself my shiny new axe. That's excellent. So now I'm also on the hunt for more meteorite as well. Okay. So, so speaking of shiny and new and things, let's equip that. Okay. So I think. Probably one of the first things we need to do, let's just close this, it's fall the 14th. Alright, we'll also check in on our quota because I think I've got to focus a little bit on that too. Alright, we need to also work on the fish for fall and I'm not quite sure why I'm bothering to water everything when I'm about to harvest it, but there you go. Just don't want to miss it I guess. So let's get the watering done and then I'm thinking that's all harvesting, isn't it? Except for a little bit over here. And there's a little bit over here. Okay. Let us go and harvest all the things. This is going to take a little bit. Peter pocket that. We needed the barley because we need the barley for Zoe and we need 300 bags of barley uh, also to unlock our steel and our beer barrel. And I think I need barley for my quota, don't I? No. Okay, my quota's done. Oh, that's excellent. Right. This is what happens when you have a few days away from uh, what you're doing. So for the curious, um, I've got my music turned down to 10% and my overall volume turned down to 33%. And I'm just wondering how you guys are finding it. I found when I was going over the last few episodes that I found the music was persistent. It wasn't, I mean, I adjusted the volume as I went, but I still found it fairly loud. And I'm just wondering if you guys are finding this episode's music a little bit loud too. I mean, I'll probably get a better idea when I go and process it just to see how it's going. is just working so hard. We have carrots now and the reason I want carrots is for our recipes because we're going to go on a bit of a recipe hunt. I wonder if there's carrot juice. People have carrot juice, right? And I also need to find some corn. Actually, no, I've got corn. 
I need to keep some corn to one side because I want to make chicha for um, for jefe. And chicha is basically corn that you put in a beer barrel. Uh, and he likes it, it's his favourite drink, so it would be nice to be able to get that up and running. I'm wondering if these are ripe, they look ripe. Losing any energy harvesting carrots, and I know for some crops I will lose energy, so I'm a little bit puzzled what's happened there. There is a massive update coming soon. Right, we'll have children in it. I was hoping to have um, Camille up to a point where she could consider you know, dating and marriage and children, but we're not quite there yet. She's not allowed to date until the new year so and we need to have someone up at 10 hearts of friendship for that so I mean I could be indiscriminate and we could um, just marry whichever character is closest to that at this point or we could look for someone special aha I did not pick the blueberries so yes yeah, so Momo has been working very hard on pumpkin days and she's been putting in some polish and making the children's update work uh, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what she's come up with and how that how that all works because because it's going to be something fairly different to what you experience in Porsche excellent we've got more mustard I planted oats here uh, and oats are not a full crop, so I lost my oats. Penelope, get off my garden, you evil sheep. But like I said, we've got our quota. What I'm doing now is working towards having the ingredients for cooking one of each recipe. Uh, and I'm thinking very soon I'm going to need a new house because I can't fit enough fridges in for my cooking ingredients. So that's going to have to happen. Man, I should. How many windmills have I got? Two or is it three? Two. All right, you know what? Oh, no. No, I don't have any. That's right. So we're going to get Zoe's bags of barley ready uh, while we harvest. We can just get them going. Is that sugar? Yes, there's Tannis's sugar. Okay. And I need to work out how to make cookie dough because I haven't done that yet and I forgot to look it up. So, uh oh. Ah, uh, there we go. Right, let's leave those. We will, once we get 200 bags of barley up and running, we will go and talk to the lovely Zoe and we'll just see what she, um, make sure that she gets her barley first and then we're going to go because she needs it by the end of the season it's the 14th uh, but we're also going to get 300 bags up so if I get another 300 lots of barley in here we're going to be able to plant that as well I know I've been running around getting treasures for the museum and I've completely neglected my farm I'm beginning to think I might I might have enough except for the barley. See, we're now starting to lose a little bit of energy. So we must be losing tiny, tiny amounts every time we harvest. There's 100 barley. I think I'm going to have to throw some more into seeds in order to be able to get my 300 barley. But I tell you what, we are coming very, very close to getting that 300 barley done.
I know, I'm going quiet. It's been a very long day. I did some words. And then I finished most of the recording for another series. Um, Yelena in my time at Porsche. We just have to wait for the update to come through and then I can finish that series off. So that'll be, that'll be good and kind of sad all at the same time. Uh, we also have, so this is, this is the main series I'm focusing on at the moment for Pumpkin Days, although I will be doing a little bit of Greta as well because I'd like to get some more of that streamed uh, on Twitch before the update comes out. So Greta's happening, maybe. Try not to plow my sheep. She's very persistent. Okay. Right, let's just go see if I've got some barley seeds already done. That's, that's oats. Yeah, we're not planting those. Let's go put them away. Uh, also, let's grab our shovel. It's in five. Wind it down to just one. At the moment, if you have your shovel set wide and you're near your trees, you will cry because you'll dig your trees up when you're digging up your poop, and that would be sad. Don't do that. So we now have a meteorite shovel, which means we're going to have a lot less trouble um, getting things done. Let's feed our chicken. Our chicken is being incredibly tolerant with our lousy feeding schedule. And also our lousy chicken cuddling schedule. We should be cuddling the chicken. There we go. Milking the cow and patting the cow. Pat the cow. Pat, pat, pat. Good cow. Oh, the bull is jealous. We'll pat the bull as well. There we go. Aha, uh -huh. I know what you were doing in the corner, Tully. Just because you're not happy does not mean you can poop under my window. I'm really glad the shovel doesn't dig up fences, though. I mean, that would be really expensive. All right. I think Zoe just wanted something like 50 bags of barley. Maybe. I, I'll go and actually I can check. What am I thinking? 50 bags of barley. There we go. Alright, let's just pick up that. And I've just discovered, I mean, it happens in the tutorial, they tell you to pick up the hay and then. Uh, then if you don't, that's what happens. Alright, let's just toddle this way. I do need a bigger barn. That's right, I have two fridges now. Yes. But as you can see, I can't fit it inside. All right, let's 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 dump our carrots and our blueberries. Uh, keep the sugar because we're going to need it. All right, I'm just trying to keep my packers as loose as I can. Keep the barley, that's in order. Uh, I was looking for soybeans, wasn't I? Oh dear, it's not looking good. Let's go see if we have enough soybeans to make one more tofu for Tucker. Vegetable dishes. Uh, actually, I'm not sure. I'm not sure it is in vegetable dishes. Yes, it is. All right, let's make Tucker one more tofu. Yes. All right, Tucker's tofu is done. Zoe's thingamie what it is done. Thingamie what's it's Hefe's lychee juice is done. That's pretty good. Okay, eggplants, green tea, mustard and black tea. Okay, I have no camellias, but I do have eggplants. Where did I see those things? They were lurking. They were lurking in one of my fridges, weren't they? Um, oh wait, they were camellias. Ha, huh, I did so too by camellias. Alright, there's my camellias to make my tea. Um, I didn't think I had eggplants and then I thought I did now why was that oh, I know because I'm driving myself insane all right that's that done it's past six o'clock so the TV recipes will have changed let's just grab those while we can green bean casserole Crafting, uranium pickaxe, clearly did not explore things fast enough to stop that happening. Let's just check in here. Alright, grab that out of there. All 
Alright, they're all done. Okay, who wanted unpolished granite? Black tea must have been. Clean. Okay, let's go get our two black tea and our three and our one green tea. Pretty sure we've got mustard. There's our mustard. Alright, two black tea. Pretty easy to make. We'll just zippity doo dah that down here. Okay, and green tea should be in here somewhere. There it is. Okay, so there's our black tea. There's our green tea. We're good. Time is at 23.03. Let's, uh, I don't think the horse is going to come. Oh, Luca, what a good pony. You're not ignoring me tonight. Some ponies get quite stroppy when it gets to 10 up. <gasps> Luca? Oh, no, again? What are you trying to do to me, boy? Get me into lots of trouble? And when exactly did you poop there? Or is that something good little horse owners shouldn't ask? Zoe. Thanks, babe. You're really welcome. Oh, wow, you must have scrambled to get all these processed. I'm so grateful for your help, babe. I'll tell you what, I actually have an extra still I don't use often. You can have it if brewing liquor is your thing. I was wondering if you could do a favour for me. It's hard to explain, but let's just say Abigail made off with one of my more expensive bottles of wine. I shouldn't steal it on purpose, I'm sure it was a simple miscommunication. Although she's taking advantage of the situation and pretending she doesn't have it. But I know she does. Do you think you can sneak into the church and get it for me if she hasn't opened it yet? I can do that. Sorry again for asking such a bizarre favour. Alright, Luca. Luca. I know, you're a good pony, but now we have to fly because Abigail's on her way back to the church and we want to get there first. Alright, so if we're very lucky, we should be able to scoot in here and grab that bottle without her seeing us. Oh, no, that's Sister Emmy's room. Ha, huh. sneaky. All right, and I'll just chat with Sister Emmy. Excuse me, I'm sorry to bother you, but I heard Taco is giving free donuts at the cafe. I really want to try one, but I'm afraid by the time I finish my studies, there'll be none left. Can you pick one up for me? Uh, I think this is going to be one of those missions I miss. Uh, yep, you're so kind. I would be. And I have a day. Okay, so I can do that tomorrow. Oh, Luca, you, you attention hog, you. I know, I probably shouldn't ride my horse in the church. Shush. Let's zip this back over to... Um, I love him, he's such a quiet pony. We'll take this back to Zoe. Thanks, babe. You're really welcome. Sweet. It hasn't been open yet either. Perfect. This is a special sweet wine I made for Lily Bean's birthday. Here's something for your trouble. All right. How you doing? I left a request on the town bulletin board today. It'd be not. It's not that important, but it'd be nice if someone would pick it up for me. I've just been too busy myself lately. Okay. It's 1.33 in the morning. I will... Check the request board. And that's a good payment to have. Okay. What is my cash flow like? 11,000. That's not too bad. Uh, masu, jalapeno sandwich, coriander, lemon tea. I can do that. Uh, mayonnaise. I, I can't yet because I don't have a mayo maker. I know where to find time, so we'll grab that. That's for Zoe's. All right, let's take Luca back home. So basically, if we're looking at doing as speedy a run as we can, we need to have um. Oh, let me get it right in a minute. Pop that over there. We need to have as many things in place as we can. Collect that, put that away. 
and what we do, we'll grab this and I'll pop that in there and we'll turn the rest of that barley into seeds. All right, that, that's going to be our 300 bags of barley uh, once they're all done. So before we go to bed, I suppose, we'll have a very quick look oops, through these guys in Pumpkin Vale. Harsha, they, them, Tessa, Vera, Zoe, Sebastian's the highest on our list. He's, been, he's a vegan, though, which might not go so well on the farm. Claudio, he's not too hard to chase down. Jelmo, I'm not sure I like his snideness. Tucker's another vegan. Fayaz, Fayaz is very over the top, but he's kind of cute. Evan, a bit serious, over at the museum. Maybe. Alex, the vet. No, that's not the vet, that's the farmer. Jackie, Jamie, I don't like Jamie, he keeps calling me Junior. It's not an equitable way to start things. Orpheus is a snot. Alec is a vet, he's also vegan. Eddie's taken. Feebat's a sleepy fisherman. El Toro, mm, let's just say I'd rather not. Nicholas is kind of sweet, we could go with Nicholas, I guess. I don't know. But it looks like we've got a long way to go on everybody's hearts. So why don't we just, I don't know, work work to get their heart relationship up. There is someone else that uh, that's interesting over in uh, Wahoo, not Wahoo, Spoonie Island. I kind of like Corin. He's a bit cute. Uh, so we might, we might start zipping over to see him every day as well. Okay. J donuts for Emmy. Let's go and get Emmy's donuts as soon as we've done our watering. Hello Pony, I'm going to need you in a minute to so make sure you've got everything done you want done. How oh, I miss the flowers not quite what I had in mind. Looks like I've got some more carrots coming up. I'm not sure what I was thinking. Uh, and there's the sheep. You want to pat sheepy sheep. So you can pat the sheep with the watering can. She doesn't mind. We shall pat the cow and milk the cow. She's not ready. No worries. We shall cuddle the chicken. And put the chicken down. Put the chicken down. Step away from the eggs. We shall feed the chicken. Steal the eggs. Oh, we shall grab our 300 bags of barley. Fine. We'll grab them in a minute. Yeah, okay. We're going to have to wait for our barley to process. Uh, and I need my pony. Oh, and before we jump on that, we'll check our check the rubbish bin. That actually has rubbish in it. Maybe we should leave that there. Okay, so I'm lost again. Okay, tofu for Tucker. And I'm supposed to be making friends with everybody. I keep forgetting. Farmer, not social bean. Oh, and I've got to get Emmy's donuts. Right. Turker. Rock on. You're welcome. Dude, look at all this tofu. I'm going crazy over here. You're a real homie, you know that. Thank you so much. You're probably heckin' tired from working all day, so here are some sandwiches to keep your energy dude. up. Dude. Evan's such a cool dude. Yep. Dude. Ain't no dairy in my bacon bra. I dare you to try Dude. and find a difference. Certainly welcome the company, but I'm out of things to talk about. See, I'm thinking as a farmer, I like my dairy and I like my meat. Game for Eddie. I can return that for you, kiddo. All right. All right, thanks. Okay. Okay, I did ask her if she needed anything. Now, we don't have very long to go find Sister Emmy, so I think maybe what we do is we should probably focus on where she might be. 
She should be... Uh Aha, coming down the street is what I was about to say. Hey, hey. Oh, thank you so much, but it turns out Sister Joan already got some for me. I'm sorry I made you waste your time. I want you to keep those donuts as an apology. Excuse me, Camille. In my visions, I saw this was your favourite food. It's unlike me to ignore a sign, so I prepared some for you. Thank you. The air goddess is incredibly capricious, just like the wind itself. She can be calming and soothing, but also rage like a tornado. As a farmer, that must be incredibly frustrating. Even though we worship a goddess, our order isn't all female by design. We'd all love to have a brother among us. It just sort of ended up like this coincidentally. I borrowed a cassette from Vera. Can you return it for me, please? I sure can. Thank you so much. Okay. I'm thinking we might focus on the museum and then on making friends. But while we're here, let's check a couple of things out with Eddie. So, hi Sean. Hi. How's it going? Took a while, but Eddie finally completed the batch of new processes. Any extra ones we have, we sell on the mainland. Cool. Huh? Are you done? Cool, man. It ain't much, but it's yours. I thought it was me returning something. How are you doing? Shauna is the best. I can't bother thinking about stuff like finances and junk, but she takes good of all that for me. Okay, buy and sell. Yes, he is now stocking cheese and mayo makers. Let's pick up two. One for cheese and one for mayo. I may have already done this. I have already done this. I feel silly. That's okay. It's been a while since I played. Ah, uh, being bad at being home. Alright. Have a nice day. I will. Even if I bought some extra stuff I didn't need. <laughs> oh, let's say hello to... Ha <laughs> ha! If you dare! Oh my gosh. You, what's wrong? Have bands invaded your farm? No, it's... Ha <laughs> ha! If you dare! You must beware the mask, eh? Ha ha! If you dare! You know what? I will return your comic book, El Toro. It is fine. Even though she's right here in this house. Thanks. Hey, you're welcome. Okay, Hi. do you have anything for me? How's it going, Camille? Okay, the processes Hi. are done. Nope, that's all I got, you know. That's okay. Alright, so now that, now that we've done that, who else have we got to see? Uh, Vera, well, she's across the road. I might as well just jog. And then we might head over to Sebastian. Thank you, come again. You're welcome. We hope you'll come again. Okay. Alrighty, you know what? We should also see if we can build. Excellent. So I'm tempted we could build a nice country house if we had 200 planks. Or we can build a large barn. Let's upgrade that. Yes. Uh oh, it's not going to fit there anymore. No. Okay, fine. I'm going to sit it over here. Oh, we will just pivot it. G to snap to grid, out of right turn. There we go. Alright, I'm going to put my cows up in the top corner. Actually, I don't like it facing at me. Oh, yes, I do. It'd be fine. See, there are my milk processes. Okay, anything else? No, never mind. I'm going to have a nap. So, you know what we can do now? Where did my pony go? Oh, that horse. There he is. Okay. So we deliver the thing to Vera. Now we've got T for Sebastian. I know. I do it to myself every time. All the errands. Just kind of aim for the windmills. You'll be right. Oh, sorry, pony. There we go. Okay, come this way. How you doing? Unfortunately, sometimes we get some really bad weather around here. In that case, some of your crops will get destroyed. It's a bummer, but that'll happen when you work out with nature. Two lemon tea. Oh, okay. I forgot. I should go make that. Okay. Who is the black tea for? That was for Rose. And the mustard was for Evan. Alright, well, Evan will be back here pretty quick. I feel like I've got nothing done, but I've been doing a ton of errands. Alright, we'll zip over this way. 
black tea for Rose. Actually, Rose is a pain to deliver to if you don't get to her in time. And we we're going to go see Corin. Oh man, where is she? Oh, it's only 13.55. Hang on. Day for journal. Black tea for Rose. Yeah, she's over at the calf. Hopefully they won't be too cross if I fill her order now. Hey, hey. Thanks, guy. I like keeping extra food around when I'm working so I don't have to get up. I guess you can have some of it since you helped me out. Have you been to Wahoo Beach recently? I was wondering if you could do me a favour. Oh, fabric patterns. However, the post office there has been backed up. It'll take a while to get here. I've already been waiting for a week. I thought it'd be faster to ask someone who travels there to pick it up for me. Are you sure? It's pretty far. Well, Kaishan should have it out on the front desk. Thanks for the help, guy. Oh, no. I think this is one of those timed ones. Uh, which means we're going to go right away while I sort it out. Two days. Well, that's a little bit better. Let's see if we can get it done anyway, because knowing me, if I do something, uh, you know, if I'm not careful, I'll end up falling over or something. Wahoo Beach. Travel. Yes. And I don't think I'll get back in time to give it to Rose, but I'll at least get it back in time maybe to pick it up. Kai Shen. I think he's right here, isn't he? Yes. Hi Kai Shen. I'm after this. Gorgeous. I don't believe we've been acquainted. My name is Kai Shan. I own a clothing boutique here in Wahoo Beach. I can tell by looking at you that you would look amazing in my clothes. I hope to see you again, gorgeous. Ooh, isn't he smooth? Run along now. Okay, he's not that smooth. Run along. Come on, pony. Oh, really, Luca? Really? Can we just, you know, go? Everyone's looking. What are you doing? Okay, so it's 17.34. We're not going to get back in time to catch Rose at her shop because she is going to be locked inside until about 4am. So we're going to have to catch her in the morning. Uh, and this is why we didn't leave this errand until the last minute because Rose is a pain in the neck to catch. And I, I don't want to miss out on the... Um, you know, on, on getting that mission done. Alright, we're just going to... I'm hoping to see Corin. I just don't like my chances with the weather. But you never know, maybe it's not raining on Spoonie Island. Maybe he's still there. We'll find out. It's an awfully long way for Camille to go for romance. So. It's just he has blue hair. Okay, so so does Claudio, but Claudio's got airs and graces. Kaishan just seems a bit more down to earth. Let's just check it out. Sometimes he's round the back. Not today. Okay, sometimes he's down on the beach in the evening. I'm thinking. Oh, there we go. Hi. Hey, Camille. Oh, I just kind of fix stuff on the island using stuff I find at the dump. It's not that interesting. Warm weather like this is good. You don't have to worry about getting a cold. At least that's how I think it works. I'll get back to work then. So the thing with Kaishan is I don't know him very well. Oh, no, not Wahoo. Spoonie. Corin, not Kaishan. Corin. He likes recipes made with any kind of berry and metal bars. Alright. I'm I'm thinking berry tea and berry pies. Let's head back to Pumpkin Vale. Oh, I'm daft. I should have taken the um headed out to the caves. So if if we're gonna romance Kaishan, uh Corin, not Kaishan, 
then we should probably think about the foods he likes. But in the meantime, I have errands to run. So lemon tea, Evan. Where is Evan? He's probably... He's still coming. We'll give him a little bit of time. Eggplant, green tea. I think I've got eggplants growing. Green tea for tackers, though. I know I've got green tea on me, so we'll just head for him. Here he is. Just trying to knock him off the stairs. You've been a big help, champ. I went out and bought you something to eat in return. I hope you like it. My old boss wasn't exactly understanding if we messed up his orders. Oh, I'm not like him. Wow. A salted cashew bar? Awesome. Alright. Mustard for Evan, thyme, eggplant, lychee juice for Hefe. I'm not sure I'm going to catch Hefe. I think he's already gone to bed. I might have to make a, an effort to catch him in the morning. Oh, sorry Pony. Yeah, see that man works hard all day and now he's at home and I don't know him well enough to, to visit. See, he's awake. If I was better friends, I could go in and see him and deliver. We need to work towards that goal, I think. Oops, I don't think Hefe's an eligible bachelor either. Okay, so I've got a couple of things I can... Um... Ooh, what's grown over there? That looks good. Does it look tasty? I don't know, let's go find out. See, I am growing. That's where I saw my eggplant. It's just not ready yet. Cauliflower. Nice. We can have cauliflower soup or something. If we had cheese, we could have cheese and cauliflower soup. This is fall, I've got to remember to pick all my flowers um, before the last day. So maybe maybe on the 27th we'll pick all the flowers and the bees will go dormant and um, we'll, we'll just sell the flowers at auction. spy some blueberry pie I mean blueberries <laughs> actually let's jog up to the library and see if they have a recipe for cookie batter because I know uh, there's a mission we've got that is rapidly catching up with this I think I might have missed it. I think I think we were supposed to get stuff together for a birthday. It might have been for Nicholas's birthday. Oops. And we we was it involved cookie dough, and I couldn't find the recipe, and the experimenting didn't work um, this time because I just didn't quite work out what I needed. Let's have a look and see. Okay, pie. So the pie recipes are in flour, salt, and butter. But there is no cake recipes in. And I didn't have enough ingredients to experiment and work it out. Oh, that's sad. So that letter is probably a disappointed letter from Sebastian telling me how I let him down. No, it's from Eddie. Do you own any sheep? I'm thinking of building this complex fabric machine that will dye wool and turn it into cloth all at once. I'm going to need to see if there's a demand for it. If you ship 50 wool, I'll start carrying the fabric machine. Well, to ship 50 wool, mate, I'm going to need 
a few more sheep than I have now. Um, one sheep will take me 50 days. Two sheep. 25 days. See, and people wonder why I have so many sheep when I finally get them. A, because there's only a small chance of breeding the rare sheep and they're cute. But B, ah, oh, look at this. Ooh. I need to unpack things. And maybe put food down for these guys. And I filled these troughs this morning. Oh, okay, that's all right. You know that's not helpful, Tully. So, seeing as everyone's sleeping on the other side of the barn... That's not going to fit there, is it? All right, I'll just snap it around this way. And I'm going to have the same problem with this one. Nope, I'm not. But it looks weird with one just being... Okay, so it's going to look weird. That's fine. Hear them all tucked up. I better fill their troughs again though. They'll eat from them no matter what. Okay. Poor critters. Just make sure the chicken is fed. And okay, I can't cuddle it. So basically what I need to do now is maybe make some mayo. Maybe pick this up out of here. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. And I'm going to pop it down over here. That's the biggest barn, so I don't need to worry about moving it again. Where's that trellis? Because that's kind of cute. Okay, and then I can move my windmills. Let's just pull everything out of them first. Just in case things disappear from them when I do that. So just grab my two windmills. All right, and we're going to dump them down here. So I'll just... Pop that. Well, that's just weird. It won't go flush against the side of the farm. Just pick this one up. I think it's being a menace. All right, I might be able to get it in now. Let's just check. No, okay. So I think I just need to pick up these things. I know, I had to pick it up anyway. not how I want them, I want them facing. 
So 20 years later, the farmer finally decides what way around she wants her windmills. I know. Now they're good. Okay, so we're going to go over here. We're going to put the poop barrels. Uh oh, I thought it was getting a bit light. But the, oh man, and now it's raining. Poop barrels over here. And I want my milk processors down. I need a processing shed. Okay, now I'll go to bed. Come on, farmer. You can have a short nap because very soon you need to wake up for Rose. Okay, let's go find Rose before anything else. Oops. Where's my door? Oh look, my eggplants are flowering. So it's 10.45 or 46, which means uh, Rose should be, let's just grab this, coming out of her house soon-ish. All right, she's not out of it yet though. Pop this here, fig jam, acebi, umeku, cheese, one cheese, I can do cheese, kleiner humite, milk, one milk I can do, okay. Alright, very soon Rose should be awake and I can give her her package and hopefully it'll be soon or she will have soggy cloth. She's still asleep, that's terrible. Alright, I might go pay off my um my debt so I can make myself another let's get out of the rain. Yeah, so let's pay off five thousand gold. Pay Yes. Talk to Hunjay. Jerk! Hey, how are you, Hunjay? Why are you bothering me? No, you don't have to go away. I guess I can put up with you for your Jerk! When you come by the post office, let me know if I can help you with anything. So I can get you out the door quicker, of course. Don't get the wrong idea. Yes, I'm still here, sweetie. Oh. Alright, so it's probably just a matter of me doing little bits and bobs until... And there she is. I'm going to stop her in the middle of the rain. Man, she's not stopping. Come here, Rose. Hey, thank you so much for bringing me this package. I really appreciate you. Here, you can have this. Dahlia made way too much and I eat like a bird, so... So uh, it's been nice talking to you and uh, I guess I bought you a snack to say thanks or something. Cute. I actually enjoy the rain. I'm going to do some hand sewing today so I can enjoy the sounds. Hi. What? Huh? Oh, I was asleep? That's weird. That's about it, guy, I guess. Thanks, Rose. Fig jam. Oh, okay, we've already plundered the message board. Let's go see if Julian has an errand. How are you doing? <laughs> I can't make heads or tails of all the newfangled filing system and computer programs that Tessa uses to run my office. I remember when all this sort of thing was on paper. Though having all your mail as electronic mail does waste this paper, I suppose. Hey Tess. Oh, um... Have you seen my pen? I seem to have replaced it and oh, it was behind my ear, silly me. Oh, um... I hope you've been making lots of friends here. Some of the residents can be prickly, but they're nice enough if you oh, get to know them. Oh, um... Yep, I don't have any more time. I'm very busy. That's okay Tess. I'm gonna head back to the farm to make someone lemon tea. I hope I as well talk to everybody on the way there. Hey Alec, how are you doing? 
definitely have to get, let me know when some when you get some cows. I've got cows. They're cute. I just want to hug them. Hey, actually, speaking of cows, can we can we um, see if we can get baby cows? Because they would be cute. Yes. All right. I'll place an order with the store to bring you a new baby animal. Hey, Alec. Hannes. Whatever. Yes. You actually got it. Thanks. You're really nice. I hope you rot your teeth with sugar someday on pastries like the ones I'm about to make. Love to take care of you, though. Would you like some herbs, money? I wasn't calling you honey. I'm giving you an actual jar of honey. What? Tara needs to stop being a baby and let one of us take her in. I want to help. It irritates me how she's such a sad sack. What? I'd like you to get sick soon, so I can see you, of course. What? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> no more business, huh? You're, you're not that sweet, Dennis. Can I ask you something? Do you go outside of town often? I was out the other day to gather herbs for medicines, and I think I dropped a small key from my pocket. I was wondering if you'd seen it. If not, do you think you can take a look for me? I'm pretty busy in the office. I haven't had a chance to look very hard for it. Sure to care. Thanks, I really appreciate it. Alright, Takeo's lost key. That I'm going to need the horse for. Well, you know, I don't need the horse for it, but it's quicker if I do. And it's bucketing. You know what? Well, we're out this way. How much time have I got? Two days. Okay, cool. While I'm out this way, we might head over to Spinny Island and uh, visit... What's his face? The dude whose name starts with K and who isn't Kaishan. Corin. There you go. I'm so good at names. Alright, now I think the key... I'm just looking for spiders. There's the key. Okay, let's grab the key. There we go. Uh, we are going that way. Alright, so if I remember rightly, Spoony Island is kind of along this road, sort of. There's grasshoppers. Do I have a bug net? I think I got given a bug net. Oh, wow. Okay, here we go. The path is a lot clearer. That's kind of cool. So we are heading, hopefully, Yes, we're heading for the Spoony Island Bridge. So we're going to dash over there. We're going to say hi to Corin. And, um... Actually, do I have space? I have a little bit of space in my pack. And I have blueberries. So why don't I see if Corin likes blueberries? And, um... And then we might swim to Spoony Island. And not pass out, because that would be embarrassing. And uh, maybe we'll find some more Cassiterite. I know, that poor male girl. She's running her heart out. It's 16.18. Which means Corin should be hopefully having afternoon tea out the back. is. Ha, oh, we're getting good at this stalking business. Hey Camille, I could use some sleep about now. I haven't slept in 30 hours. Ah, uh, I just kind of fixed stuff up on the island, using stuff from the dump. Yeah, I can return that. Although, I think if you wait a little bit, Rockman will be here soon, won't he? Well, this is one way to find Rockman. Where is he usually hanging out? Because I have no idea. This is not my home island. What are you doing to me? Okay, so Frogman's house is not oh, it's green. Well, that makes so much sense. And he's probably sleeping. All right. I figured he's usually out in the afternoon talking to Corin. Maybe not this afternoon, though. 
Yeah, no, he's asleep. All right, well, he's not know where his house is. What we're going to do is we're going to swim out to uh, the cave. And I'm going to try not to drown. Wrong one, I want this. All right, a salted cashew bar. I'm, ah, cookies will give me some speed. So we're going to have the cookies. We're going to have the cashew bar. And we're going to sort all of this stuff up. There we go. Oh, I forgot to go see Hefe today with his lychee juice. I'm hopeless. All right, we're just told this way. Okay, and stop. We're going to eat the cookie. Excellent. Now we have a little sneaker, but cookies do not last very long, so we've got to swim quick. We have full health, so we would make it even if we hadn't eaten, so that's pretty good. Just make sure I'm not going to get caught up on the edge here. Sure. We made it. And the reason you don't want to get caught on the edge is because you start drowning pretty quick. So let's go three. Agate. We've got that. Salt. Copper. Tungsten. Amber. Cassiterite, I think, is the hardest thing to get, so it's one of those things you've just got to be pretty persistent about finding um, if you're determined to fill your museum. I know, we'll worry about dig spots in a minute, because so I've got to come back this way anyway. Opal, Unikite, I don't think I've got Unikite. Okay, Unikite might be one of my new ones, that's pretty good. Cassiterite, yes. So, I'm glad we cancelled the order for Tucker because you need four bits of Cassiterite to cook them into one bar. And um, his order would have meant we would have had not enough to fill, fill that requirement. So that's one less ball we need. We should also start doing a bit of fishing too, so... Copper and iron. And dig. So sand. Sand. Okay, that's that done. Go back this way. Swim around the corner best we can and then jog jog fast there you go more sand and more sand we're hoping for some of the coins that you can get in here maybe some of the coins that we haven't got I know So there's still a few gemstones we don't have. Unikite was one of the ones we don't have. And I probably need to remember to eat something. Let's eat number six. Ooh, that was pretty good. Gold. Always happy to sell gold. Cobalt. Shovel. Number five. It's eight o'clock at night. We're going to have to head for home soon. Pumpkin coin. I'm not sure we've got that one. Okay, that's everything from this spot. I think. I'm pretty sure I dug the chest up. That was over here. Yeah, okay. So we've dug everything up over here. I mean, that looks like a passage, doesn't it? But it's not. Yeah, see. So, that next patch is going to have a ton of content. Um, 
Anakin was working on mazes today. So I'm kind of excited to see that. And what else did she do? Working on paintings inside the buildings. Just changing a few around. That was kind of pretty. So yeah, there's, there's a few things. So of course, by the time you see this, it'll be well past when I saw her doing that. And the patch that I'm talking about should be live. Hopefully. used to be every time you dug one of these when we first started playing it was it was guaranteed a coin or um or something and then and then you started getting you know find the coin then you started getting things like crabs and rubbish in them and that was fun but uh, now you can get sand and sand is pretty useful we can make a bunch of glass uh, we can make glass animals out of them i think it's kind of cool that. So I'm going to jog right over to the edge and then we're going to eat our cookies again. Um, simply because they're going to make us that little touch faster. It would have been better if I'd gotten, which I think I have got a pie in here somewhere. Oh, my mistake, I don't have a pie in here somewhere. Oh dear. Okay, that's fine. We're going to eat our cookies anyway. It's much better than tossing our cookies. Okay. Let's eat that and go for a swim. Alright, we're aiming for the beach. Um, we don't go as fast with cookies as we do with cakes, so we're probably going to start running out of air. Not as badly as we would have if we didn't have the extra speed. So we talked to Karin and we did not experiment on him with blueberries, much to my shame. Uh, and there's our losing energy sign, but we're good. Okay, let's go see if Frogman's up or if he's still asleep, because he might still be asleep. He's looking... Yep, he's out to it, poor man. He, he has a fatigue kind of condition, where he sleeps a lot of the time. It's not as much fun as it sounds. Who's that? Alexis. Salutations, young one. I'm Alexis Klinger, though you may call me Madam if you wish. I've decided to settle here on this island as humans here are very accommodating and continue to amuse me. I do believe you shall also find them to be so. And that's Lan the Doctor. Okay. Where is my pony? You cheeky boy. Come here. Alright, let's head for home. I did deliver Rose her package. Look at that rain, it's awesome. I love the rain, I love it in real life too. Okay. Alright. Oh, I need to put a bottle of milk in the milk, in the cheese maker. I should probably put some eggs in the cheese maker as well. That'll give me mayo. Do I have any butter on the run? Oh, oh, nut butter. I keep forgetting I can make it. Oh, my butter woes are nearly over. I also need to sell, uh, sell enough stuff that, that we make milk out of. Let's just get that there. So, we did a lot of errand running today. We did get some cassiterite, which I'm going to process next session. And, um, and we're still trying to decide on who we're going to marry. So, if you've enjoyed this episode, please hit like. If you want to see more, please hit subscribe. And I will catch you later. We better deliver Doc his key tomorrow as well. So, no sleeping in. There we go.